Hello and welcome to the 2017-2018 Ferris State Men's Basketball Preview. I'm Rob Bentley and joined by the head coach of the Ferris State Bulldogs, Andy Brockema. Coach, I know you're excited about a, another season uh, getting underway here for the Bulldogs. Yep, it, it seems like this offseason flew by. It was the shortest one ever and the uh, season's here and we're, we're ready to go. Obviously, you've had a chance to work with your guys a little bit here and now practice underway. Uh, just talk about what you've seen uh, with so much returning experience. Well, we've had an injury. We got a guy playing playing football right now, so you know it seems like we're down a couple bodies from last year. So uh, expectations are high, and uh, we're we're pushing um, to new heights, and we're going to see what that that has for us. Uh, you know, as far as early on with a veteran team, um, expectations could be maybe too high at the beginning, and we're still got a, a lot of a lot of room to grow, a lot of. A lot of things we need to work on early on, and I guess early on it just maybe we're not where I thought we would be. Um, but that's just a testament to you know losing guys like Quentin Ruff and you know some guys on the coaching staff and whatnot. So uh, we're a brand new team, and that's evident early, and we're just pushing to be the best we can be. Talk about uh, last year, obviously a historic season for you, and uh, some of those uh, championship experiences that you had. How how will that help you maybe uh, coming into this season? Well, it'll help us because, you know, we can just look back and say, hey, we did it one time and uh, they'll never take it away from us. But this year's a brand new year. Uh, I'm really not sure how it's going to help us other than maybe in some big games we can say some of our players have, be have been there. But this is a, a whole new team, new dynamic, guys shuffling around, different positions, different rotations. So, um, you know, we've loaded up our schedule to have, you know, 30 regular season games and some tough teams. And, and uh, the league is definitely trending up. Uh, you look at all the teams and their rosters and everybody's made improvements. So um, it's going to be a fun year. You get under the way this uh, week, obviously, against Aquinas in an exhibition game. Uh, you got Michigan State next week, and then obviously the, the small college uh, basketball Hall of Fame classic to start the year. Uh, talk about these games here and, and how uh, important it is for your guys to be ready to play right away. Well, it's important. It's important to get ready to play for these games, but it's important to, to, for us to evaluate. Um, these are still evaluation games. Uh, probably the most important game is, is the game against Grand Rapids Community College because you know, I got some family ties there, and uh, that, that one's going to be big for us. So we're looking past Michigan State, right to Grand Rapids Community College. That's uh, that's going to be a big one on the 28th for us. But the preseason's all about finding finding things out about your team and and uh, you know getting ready to go. So you hit the ground running in that uh, opening tip-off tournament. Uh, obviously, the GLIAC a uh, little bit of a new look this year with a couple new teams coming in. Uh, you lost some teams. Uh, talk about the conference race and and how challenging that will be. It's it's challenging, and uh, you know the region is different. Um, you know the, the landscape's changing. Teams switching conferences and and uh, that sort of thing. So when you're looking at the the national tournament bids, you know whether we're going to have you know one, two, or three in the GLIAC, who knows? So you pretty much got to win the thing if you if you want a chance to get in, and uh, that's a daunting task considering all the good teams that we have. And uh, you know we we do a little bit of a pre scout on on the league and the teams, and it just it just looks incredibly difficult. I mean, there's talented players that you wish were on your team, and there's talented coaches, and everybody's had the whole off season to kind of devise plans to to do what they can against um, you know the other opponents. So it's just going to be a fun year to compete, and uh, a lot of teams have a chance to win it. You mentioned the coaches. Uh, obviously, your staff a little bit different than it was last year. Uh, talk about the, the new guys coming in and, and what they bring to the to the program. Well, first of all, just keep, keeping Coach Lake around for another year is is huge for me. Um, you know, he keeps this program afloat for sure. But then, you know, Coach Killian back on staff. He's the most experienced coach we have, and uh, he's a big part of things. The, the new guys uh, with Coach Schlump. Uh, wouldn't let him retire there at Muskegon Community College, brought, brought him back to Ferris. Uh, we started out together here as volunteers and built a close relationship. And then Al Hamilton, really excited about Al joining the staff um, you know, from Farmington and, and his AU uh, Warriors team. But uh, th those guys are, are fitting in too, just like new players and trying to find their role and uh, really excited about this thing coming together. Um, I don't think we'll peak too early this year just because of the situations we're in. Um, I thought maybe last year in the middle of the season we, we got as good as we were and then, and then we sort of held it there, um, but we failed to grow um, a lot the last several games. So ho hopefully this year we can peak at the end. Finally here, some high expectations. What does it take to, to achieve some of those expectations as you go on throughout the year? Uh, probably a little bit of luck. I mean, that's, that's all there is to it. You look at every season and you say, wow. 
you know, that's unexplainable. There's things that are un unexplainable that happen. And, uh, you know, we, we work hard, do the things that winners do, and hopefully a little luck comes our way. But uh, de it definitely takes that. you got to stay injury-free. Um, you you got to, you know, you know, stay away from the flu, all these little things. Exam week, you know, guys got to be prepared. And, that, I mean, there's so many little things that, that, that come down to, you know, winning a championship or, or losing it. So um, the easiest way to explain it is just uh, let's be lucky. Coach, best of luck to the Bulldogs. Looking forward to another season of Ferris State basketball. Thanks. That's going to do it for the Ferris State basketball preview. Find out more online at ferrisstatebulldogs.com.